It's the beginning of summertime, which means you're making plans to go out on vacation and the kids are hanging outdoors. Now, while you're getting excited for all that summer fun, there's a few little things you want to keep in mind when it comes to hanging outdoors. We're seeing an influx of ticks. These crawling creatures are making their presence known outdoors. Since 2004, the number of illnesses caused by tick, mosquito, and flea bites have increased more than three times. But for what reason? It's probably related to the warming uh, temperatures. It stays warmer longer, the moisture. Leon Bullard is a medical consultant with DHEC. He says you can find ticks in any wooded area, in your backyard, or in tall grass. To be careful and check your children when they come inside. Make sure that they're protected when they go outside using appropriate uh, insect repellents. What do you do if you have a tick on you? Some people like to use Vaseline or burn the end of a tick with a match, but... It's a bad idea. It's been enculturated in us as we've grown up. The best bet is to follow the guidelines recommended by the experts, which is to use fine pointed tweezers and grasp it close to the skin and lift straight up. Once the tick is out, there's still more you should do. Make sure that you dispose of it properly and then wash your hands completely with an alcohol-based rub if you can and certainly clean the site where the tick was very thoroughly with soap and water and maybe even apply a, an antibiotic ointment. Some of the best ways you can prevent being bit by ticks is using repellents that contain 20 percent or more DEET, keeping your arms and legs covered while outdoors, and conducting a full body check after you come in from outside. In Columbia, Nick Jones, News 19, WLTX. Nick, thank you. If you weren't able to write down all of these tick tips down quick enough, don't worry. You can find it all on our website, WLTX.com.